medals, though quite how in 1999, they will never know. Prior to that, 1968, the first English triumph. Chelsea, twice winners of the old Cup Winners Cup. But this, a brand new experience in Europe's senior. And the pitch will be closely monitored. But both camps making light of any potential difficulties. Neither manager is going to allow it to be an excuse. Manchester United champions in every sense. In parts, the Andersons. And they might need that defensively against a pretty effective Chelsea side from set plays. Well, to accommodate uh, Balak and Lampard, Essien is the Chelsea right back. Strong candidate to play in the middle where he did uh, at Stamford Bridge uh, recently and very effectively. Team in blue here. That, uh, <laughs> took a trajectory that almost caught out the fluorescent. Ronaldo coming in more centrally to try and get into the game. Working with Rooney. Great footballers, but it is attack. Ronaldo. So Cole. Uh, had Players out there are plenty who can open this game in a flash, like Cristiano Ronaldo. It's too high for Hargreaves. And it's just too long for Brown to keep in. Well, for all Essien's qualities, and there are many, I wonder if one... Back Evra. In tandem with Ronaldo again. And they've worked it well between the two of them. Kicked him against Rogba. Ronaldo, way behind Paul goals, but obviously with any blow to his face, they'll be thinking back on that. And here's Brown for Ronaldo. In the 26th minute, his 42nd goal of the season. It's come against Chelsea. It's come in the Champions League final. Do you think Alex Ferguson feels justified in the way he started? The positive system, because the wide left midfield player comes on top of Essien. We've talked about how good this guy is in the air and how he claims. Now just watch this, wonderful football here. They just play it round beautifully. But look at the way he pulls on Essien and he hangs it up there, Wes Brown, and says, go on, Cristiano. Straight back straight away and they could have done. You will find it. Here's the that side of the pitch to suggest they might make a goal from that area. Instead, they've scored one. Games where Manchester United have gone away in Europe. That's Drogba, who gets to it. And Balak was coming in. Well, I have to say, Edwin van der Sar's looking a little edgy to me. Again, a decision make. This is his ball I talked about. The left. Looking for Cristiano Ronaldo, who's really on the gallop. It's a great ball. Into Tavares! Oh, what a goal it would have been! It might yet be for Carrick, but checks there again. That would have been the Champions League finals, one of the all time great goals. What a break! From the right corner of the box to the left corner of the other side of the pitch. What an angled ball that is! And I'm thinking, why is he crossing it? United attack. Terry has to deal with it this time. Chelsea players, he might have been back or trying to get back now. Rooney fired across for Tevez, and thanked by surprise that it got beyond Makalele. Well, I use the word gamble all the time, you know that. And Tevez has to gamble, and I don't know if he... And the Chelsea player create a gap in that wall for Balak. And he wasn't shooting at that level. The game would be a very cautious chessboard affair. Goal has changed that, here's Essien. Oh, and it might run here. And it has for an equaliser, which is poached typically by Frank Lampard. Right on half time, Chelsea are level against the balance of the match. That is what this game is all about. That is what this sport is all about. Hang on in there, don't concede. And you might just get lucky. And that's what they've got. Very, very lucky. Two deflections, I think, one off Fidic.
Then off and back at Manchester United. And you know, maybe, just maybe, Michael Essie. Now they'll get everybody around him. It's a card for Cavalier. And his uh, fellow countryman. Why is Macaulay? Two big chances for Carlos Tevez at 1 0, which was presented by Ronaldo. It's the Manchester United are facing English opposition in a European setting. Eight Champions League matches against the Liverpool in recent with the Spain and it's Evra. That's it back. Flamboyant domination is. Ronaldo taking over, and again they've got behind uh, Chelsea, Evers cross, Hargreaves again willingly had come in, in fact, he probably was in the right position, the cross was a bit too high for him, but you yeah. could say he'd come in too far. Lovely football again, I mean they just play around Michael Essien yet again. And a fine ball to the raiding Essien, he's still going, he's lost Ronaldo completely. And then... Uh... I'm going to tell you something Martin, you watch this shot, as it's crossing the goal line, that area of the goal, Danny Anderson. This is Balak. We've got a game here, folks. We really have a proper game. Would like to have been on the end of his own cross there, if you see what I mean. And then the referee... Ronaldo, able to turn. Chelsea didn't get uh, Maluda out. Cavallo has shown a knack of scoring against Manchester United. Very good piece of defending Balak. That's Lampard. Another Chelsea. Van der Sar was in the mix of that and not in command. John Terry is. Uh, Margaret's trying to tee up Carrick, who was uh, allowed to uh, actually let fly when the ball got away from him for a moment. And there's a lovely pass to Essien. It's the way for Manchester United to strike back. Do uh, I guess he can do what he's uh, not so comfortable? Joe Cole can't with believe it again this defending. time. <laughs> Terry putting it in as he lost his balance. Oh, Maloda! And uh, Ferdinand turns away, and Lubos Mikel made a move, but it wasn't to uh, to him. His drug poor. Lost his footing and then shoots! Oh, and hits the frame of the goal. The cup final specialist so near to a champion. And, uh, well, Ferdinand lost his footing, he's trying to get back in towards Drogba from Maluda. And Chelsea were very nearly in again. It's been the story of this second period. Yeah. But we have mentioned Evra. Tevez, who's got so many valuable goals, so many late goals too, in his first season as a Manchester United player. That's uh, the way it is. Such a likeable lad and uh, away from him. Drogba near post and needed to be watched. Um, Paul Scholes, who has been very involved despite that from Patrice Evra. Ronaldo. What a ball. What a ball. Ryan Giggs, moment of glory. Because this could not... United. There goes the whistle. The goals came in the first half from Cristiano Ronaldo and Frank Lampard. Chelsea... Yeah. Well, in the starting uh, 11, the referee's not going to wait for the substitution. Steve Clark uh, has got a bit... Carrick, Giggs, Tevez, Rooney, nearly. Oh, super little interplay there. I think there's just a little touch. Not sure who from. From a Chelsea player, right... Ronaldo resuming his uh, torturing of SEM when they get into those situations. He... Ashley Cole got the run of it against the Hargreaves. Balak, Lampard turns, hits the bar. Joe Cole. Well, they're Millimeters not in it for they're Chelsea. Not come any closer. When Rooney just gets caught ball watching. Hard at the other. I guess that's them dead level and everything now, Martin. Both have had two glorious opportunities. United two, 
it was a good option he created Didier Drogba's goal in injury time against Liverpool in the semi-final uh, sorry extra time and it was Ronaldo Evra it's a storming run here oh John Terry off the line John Terry what what a piece of defending Ryan Giggs can't believe it I don't think he's quite hit it the way he intended Ryan Giggs otherwise I don't think John Terry could have done anything about it but I Manchester United have had them, three of them. The shirt's off. He's personally devastated. He'll know what the uh, what's best for the. Tevez changes direction so well, but when the shot comes in from that angle, it's pretty comfortable for Petr Cech. And, uh, Carvalho. Well, his wasn't a chance, but how close is Kalou to getting on the end of this? Maybe of a. A wearying mind. They don't get much of a, a respite at the turnaround in the uh, extra 30 minutes. Well, I don't know about the two sets of fans and coaches and players and everything. Be the one who makes a mistake. So, yeah. Avenue here. Ronaldo. It is Drogba. But, uh, he did go that uh, shorter side. Square ball, wasteful ball. Ronaldo. A couple of times. <laughs> Twice they've done it in the game to Manchester United. All right, I, I just don't understand it, Martin. What? And it's red for Drogba. Well, Chelsea have brought. Let me tell you something, Martin. Chelsea have brought this upon themselves. For raising an arm, I guess. Tevez had a part in it. His is yellow. Didier Drogba. It goes to penalties. 1 1 after 90 minutes. And 1 1. The shootout to be started by Carlos Tevez for Manchester United. And he sends Petr Cech the wrong way with a superb penalty. Does he smash it out of Edwin van der Sar's right or does he change? Good luck, boys. Chelsea's first penalty. Van der Sar thought it was going the other way to the one at Stamford. And scores again here. 2-1 Manchester United. And with the greatest step forward, and you trust your technique and your temperament, Van der Sar tries to make himself big against the Brazilian. Giuliano Balletti. And everyone's spot on with four. The world is watching. And Shimmy. And Czech has saved from Ronaldo of all people. I told you. I told you. Big, big step, and he waits and he looks. He's taken some pressure penalties before and since and scored. And he drills this one in. And Chelsea lead. Well, a man from Russia who has backed Chelsea with his rubles. Hargreaves gets it up and over check. Oh, that was a it's usually a calm side-footed approach. Let's see what he's got here against Van der Sar. Oh, it got in just, just, but just is enough for Chelsea. They're getting another who is infinitely less experienced. Nani keeps Manchester United in it, who has felt the pain of the semi-final defeats in the Champions League for Chelsea. Has the chance to win the Champions League for Chelsea. And it's a chance that has passed him by and the agony is there again. Watch him slip, Martin. Not scored a, a regulation goal for Manchester United, but he rams Manchester United back in front in the shootout.
Kalou holds his nerve and holds Chelsea's place in the co a lot wiser and he hopes a lot more accurate here in Moscow tonight he is but what do I know he didn't look happy coming forward Anelka and he's not happy now because it's red in Russia this English night in Europe is Manchester United's night best in the Premier League, their best in the Champions League. Thank to Edwin van der Sar's save. Ronaldo's had a reprieve. And Manchester United's joy is unconfined. For Drogba. But a losing night for Chelsea. And no one. Tonight in Moscow.